With tax-free savings accounts going up, the question you're probably wondering about is, what's in it for me? Obviously, the more money you have crammed into a TFSA, the more you save. Because in other accounts, all of the money you make on dividends, interests, and wise stock market investments are taxed. TFSAs put a stop to that. The whole point is to encourage you to save more. But TFSAs are capped, so there is a limit. Right now, it's $5,500 a year, but that's going to $10,000. That's to stop the super wealthy looking to avoid taxes. They might already have offshore accounts for that. In fact, more than half the people currently maxing out their TFSA contributions are low and middle income Canadians over the age of 55. But it goes back to the question, what's in it for me? Two separate studies looked into it and paint a less rosy picture than Joe Oliver does. In fact, the government's own numbers show just 8% of working-age people contributing to TFSAs max them out. The parliamentary budget officer says the benefits skew toward the upper and upper middle-income earners who have more money to sock away. The Broadbent Institute put a number on it, saying the only people running out of room in retirement savings accounts are those making more than $200,000 a year. So the doubling likely only helps those above that. Liberals say if they get elected, the limit will roll back.